As with all of our PowerPoint presentations, you will find speaker notes included with the slides to help guide you in what I had in mind and what you might want to say as you present. Here we talk about why the revisions were made to the Y14.5 standard. And we point out that technology has changed. And you'll see that there will be several animations to help people stay awake and understand the concepts. In addition to the technology changing and our parts becoming more complex, so our standard has to keep up, we also note that there have been changes to other standards which affect the Y14-5 standard. Actually, there are two new standards that came out since the 1994 standard. They are the one on embedding your tolerances in your 3D CAD model, Y1441, and a standard on dimensioning and tolerancing principles for gauges. In addition, there was a revision to the Y14-8 standard, and so there have been some changes that reflect that. There is a greater emphasis now on design intent, and the principal changes include the addition of new concepts and symbols. There are seven new symbols clarification of concepts that were found in the 94 standard but weren't real well explained or understood, an extension of some of the principles such as composite tolerancing, now the standard shows us what it means if you have more than two segments in a composite, and resolution of differences and discrepancies such as the difference or discrepancy that existed between the Y14-5 standard and the math standard and also, as I mentioned earlier, to incorporate concepts from the Y14 standard. Now, once you've presented a few slides, you will find that there's going to be questions to test what you've just told them. We find that these questions really help to hold their interest and make sure that they heard what you were saying. So the answers will pop up on the screen and solutions are also in the back of the textbook. After they've answered a few quick questions, then you jump back into the next presentation. Now we start with section 1 and we go right through the Y14-5 standard pointing out the major changes that have occurred to each of the sections.